Hello, how are you? So today in my video, I will tell you the difference between industrial Ethernet switches and the business IT switches. And the first, I would like to tell something like dirt, dust, vibration, shocks, electrical noise, freezing cold or blistering heat. The quick answer to question of why industrial snap switches differ from business switch. That mean the industrial Ethernet switches is to appeal to withstand all the challenges. The business IT switch consists by air conditioning in data center or nestle in a quiet corner of an office where dust is a dirty word doesn't have to take dust and dust business IT switches with fans for cooling with suck in air and with it dirt or dust particle to compound the problem fans have moving parts and lower mean time between failure i mean mtbf industrial network switches do not have fan they rely on rug design to resist heat better and any build up of dirt or dust so right now i will tell you the three things the different the most different between the industrial switches and the business switches so on the table i have the two switch the one from mozart and one from the phonic contact and the first i just to provide the power supply for them so they start so you can see the time start is nearly the three seconds between the two models and right now i will tell you so on the left hand i have the manage switch and the right hand right here i have the unmanaged switch from phonix contact so come back so how do we choose the industrial switches and i will tell you more detail about this and the first number one is harsh electrical temperature consideration and remind again vibration shock electrical noise also separate the ship from the ghost when it comes to ethernet switches industrial environment typically use thin rail like this Thin rail, uh huh. Or maybe they used a uh, 19 inch rack mounting. That is standard for business IT installation. But industrial network switches are designed to avoid vibration or shock. That could make cable for loud and to make industrial, I mean EMC, electrical magnetic compare tpility by comparison business IT switches are less resistant to vibration shock and electrical noise Thus cause component burnout and other electrical damage. I mean. And again, the component to use to build industrial network switches are designed and test for operation in board operating temperature range. For example, minus 40 to nearly 75 degrees C. Um, that means minus 40 to 167 degree F. Commercial switches are built for operation within much narrow temperature range. Outside this limit, the integrated circuit may be fail when temperature are high or the network connection may lose their contact because of the cold. Industrial network, I mean, uh, switches are built to work in harsh conditions such as manufacturing transport maritime oil gates or mining i mean 
Mm, they are designed for high avail, I mean availability of a long period, because downtime costs in industrial environment are often considerable. Business IT switches may have life circle only one or maybe three years, but industrial internet switches may be kept working for nearly ten years or more. Incredible. And the number two, I would like to tell you, is management and secure consideration. Often industrial network switches have been installed, config, and left to get on with it. The priority were network speed and reliability. In order to installation, network management functionality. I mean, in the switch has were not included because it interfered with the high communication performance, high speed or low latency needed. I mean, security is. Also, larger option because yesterday, as a later industrial network, nobody could get in from the outside to hack them. Business IT switches are typically equipped for both management and cyber security. Come back with industrial network are being connected to the I mean the industrial Internet of Thing. I mean, I I O T. They will need suitable management and security. Other industrial switches will gradually be replaced by new ones. Although for on the reasonable business IT switch will not be used. That's it. And the last one I would like to tell you in this video today is the software defined networking. And you know right here is the unmanaged switches. You just plug and play, but right here you plug and play too. But you can use the LAN cable to set the computer and then to config some parameter in this model. And come back to the software defined networking, a robust, affordable solution that does have negative impact on network performance is software defined networking. By introduced SDN compatible switches in the network, for instance, as part of replaced program for other units, a software device network can make easy to configure, control, and monitor Ethernet switches. Include managing security policy in the switches on the type of traffic to let through or to block. And you know when you want to this. Port, P open. You will go to the software, maybe web browser, and then you can uh, open this port or maybe you just to uh, to set up this port is just for for this cable, maybe for the monitor screen or maybe for one computer. Depend on you. So, industrial network switches will. I mean, continue to different themselves from business IT switches, but at the same time, be on pair with them in terms of external networking, network management, and cyber security. And right now, I will show you um, the connection between the Mosa switches and another plan, right here. So right here, I have the Mosa switches right here. So on the, the equipment, I will focus on on equipment. You can see the model number and the the default IP. So actually, I change this IP. So right here, I have the Phoenix contact. This is unmanaged switch. Just plug and play. The two model is plug and play. And then right now, I will test the connection. So. Can unmanage switch from another brand right here can connect to the Mosa switches. This model have the name is EDS four a four zero eight a. And right now, I prepare the two computer. This is the first computer and the second computer, and I have the cable too. 
I have the three cable. The first cable is a little bit long. Connect to this equipment. So right here, I have plug it in. You can see. Yes, before another jack, I connect to the first computer right here. This wiring, this cable. And the next, I prepare another cable lane. Connect the unmanaged switches to the second computer. So, actually, I need to connect the, the, this switch to this switches right here. So you can see the light turn on. So you can see right here the lights it turn it on. Okay after connecting the first computer to these switches, motor switches and the second connect motor switches to the phonics contact and the last just Connect this widget to this computer right there. It's really easy. Okay, done. Everything is done. Okay. Right now, I turn it on and I will use the CMT to ping cam. This laptop ping too. Another laptop right there. Let's try it. Right here, um, this computer, I have the IP address is 192.1.1.1. Dot one and another is the 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 last number is two last number is one and then right now I will ping to from this computer to another try it through two switch completely different the first one and the second one different brand different model different i mean the managed switches and the unmanaged switches try it and then i will tie ping number two can oh no are you serious? So the request time out cannot connect. Wait, we have a problem. So this computer, I turn off the fiber. But what about this computer? Let's check. Let's work. Okay, I said to the fire work. Ah, um, yes, yeah, still turn it on. So, if I would like to ping from another car computer, I need to turn it off. Okay, right there. Okay, turn off the window fire work. Turn off the window fire work too. Okay. Try it again. Ping. Dot. Can you see? I ping. Successful. I mean, so the signal from this computer, I mean, 
through the unmanaged switch right here from Phonix contact connect to the most SAS switches manage EDS 408A and connect to another computer is ping successfully wow so about the most of switches we can use to connect and i think another friend is okay i test so come back our problem today uh, so i tell you why do we choose the industrial network uh, switches and you can hear it again and that's it today. Thank you for watching and see you next video. Thank you.